My name is Afeshi UK, and I am an assistant professor in vascular and interventional radiology in the Department of Radiology. In interventional radiology, we, it's a really unique field in the sense that we are equipped to work in every organ system in the body and provide treatment through tiny incisions on the order of a couple of millimeters and provide treatment to, to patients in that regard. When you come to work, your, your day is kind of unpredictable. You don't know what you're gonna get into in the day. Your day could be filled with doing um, cases on arteries and veins. If there's a blockage or a thrombus, I can treat that, I can open that up, I can stent it and clean it out. If there's a bleed in the body anywhere, I can access it and I can stop the bleed. Um, I do women's interventions as one of my passions. So women's, women who are dealing with fibroids and adenomyosis, I can provide a treatment and a procedure to help them deal with that. Even men's health, we can help with prostate enlargement um, and targeted cancer therapies, we can help treat that. You know, really that among many other procedures that we get to do as interventional radiologists. Um, it really is fulfilling. And um, on top of that, IR has the amazing ability to do these procedures minimally invasively. So we can offer our patients shorter recovery times, um, no big incisions. They can get, go home and get back to their normal way of life really quickly. It's really a patient-centered practice in interventional radiology at the University of Maryland. When I'm talking to a patient, I really take them as my own family member. I want to get to know them. I want to help them. I want to help educate them. I want to make sure they understand their treatment options and make sure we are coming to a decision together so that we can get them back to um, their normal way of life and their highest quality of life that they can get to. Not only are you in the community here in Baltimore where there's a need and a diverse population and I'm able to be a part of that which is very rewarding, but in the same time I'm able to be involved in research and be involved in pushing the envelope forward um, and then also be involved in education and being able to just pass the baton of knowledge onto everyone that's coming up behind me and being able to see other people grow and learn from um, what we're doing every day is also rewarding and being a part of the system it really fosters that type of growth and learning and education that I value.